Today I'm going to talk about the transmission from motor to the axle uh, for the car. Now, as you see here, we've got an XL motor that actually translates uh, uh, from the small tooth wheel for the motor onto the axis for the wheel. And there are two functions here. One is that you actually have to change the direction of the, of the, of the axle, um, but also you want to gear down. Now the problem is that with this uh, system um, that when you apply a lot of torque uh, this wheel can actually skip you know it um, um, that's really one of the big problems so if you apply a lot of resistance if it's going up a hill or if it's stuck you know this tooth wheel will skip and they'll eventually get damaged now an alternative to that is actually using uh, these type of uh, tooth wheels and these tooth wheels can actually take a lot of torque and that's actually pretty much the only reason of their existence um, but they have one problem and that is that they don't gear down it's actually just a one-to-one -one relationship so my solution is to actually uh, uh, to brace the uh, tooth wheel and even in this tiny contained space it is possible to do this by putting in um, these little pieces over here I'm going to turn this around so you have a bit of a look of it all right, here we go. So here you see the, the bracing um, that is possible. Um, and uh, with that, you uh, can actually uh, very nicely transform uh, the force, uh, and it doesn't skip. So um, that's my idea of uh, changing the direction and changing the gear ratio and still being able to transmit a lot of force.